Hello everybody, thanks for tuning in. It's a beautiful morning, like you saw earlier. And I felt like doing something with my Muji fountain pen again. Just uh, at the start I I know that the first shot is out of focus. I'm I'm going to actually I'm going to correct it in just a second. Now what I'm doing here are my first drawings of the day, my very first sketches, you know, when I have a day off or at the weekends uh, like this case, like in this case. Um I like to sit down, you know, half an hour or uh, one hour after I get up. I like to just sit down, have a coffee and do my first drawings of the day just to get warm a little bit and uh, to also, you know, wake up my brain a little bit. That's uh, also a big thing after after you wake up after a long good sleep on the weekend. And I'm doing just some simple sketches, you know, nothing overly fancy. Uh, as you can see, just getting in right with the ink, w right with the fountain pen, with no with no line work underneath or something. So not overly beautiful, finished, polished drawings, but just some basic, very basic sketches. And every time I watch these time lapses, it's so cool to see like just a plain, um, or basically some some plain line work, some plain sh outlines. Uh, transforming into actually an um, acceptable sketch you know and then going in with some with some shading and correcting some of the errors i did before and these are the first drawings of the day and the first drawings of the day always feel really weird get out of bed and you know you you haven't really um you haven't you're not fully awake yet they always feel kind of funny and uh, it's always a little bit of a challenge but it's also relaxing you know And one thing that I also really love to do in the morning is to is to move myself a little bit, you know, to to go outside and uh, breathe in some fresh air and uh, catch some sunlight. Maybe I mean uh, this time around, this time of year, it's a little bit it's a little bit difficult to catch some sunlight, but also really important. And also, you know, when you're sitting down for a long time in front of a drawing, getting outside, getting some fresh air, and cleaning. Uh, clearing your head a little bit uh, can be really helpful and then getting back to the drawings The pen that I'm using here today is my Muji fountain pen, like I said earlier. Uh, it's a really, really awesome pen. I did a more in-depth video about it uh, in another video. I'm going to link it in the upper right corner where I use this pen mainly for writing. And I was writing some Japanese letters since uh, obviously Muji is a Japanese company. And so I was writing some uh, katakana and hiragana, hiragara? No, hiragana, I think it was, yeah. <laughs> Um, really cool video, check that out. And yeah, this is obviously not what I usually do. Usually I just do some really um, detailed drawings. There is one drawing, a really big drawing, that I'm going to post soon on my Instagram and here on my YouTube channel. There's a lot of stuff on my Instagram that I don't show here on YouTube, so... And I'm also doing some giveaways there, so if you're interested in that, go check it out. Um, my Instagram name is in the bottom left corner, also it's linked in the, in the description below. And I'm glad I tried out this, this black ink. Uh, usually I just like... I mean, I usually do draw with black ink, yeah. But uh, in a fountain pen, I usually use uh, purple ink. I did many drawings here on this channel with purple ink because I think it looks really awesome uh, and I don't really see a reason why I should uh, draw with uh, black ink in a fountain pen because, you know, after all, I, ha I have so many fine liners and uh, pigment uh, liners and whatnot. But I think I'm going to do it more often and the big drawing that I have coming up soon on my channel and on my Instagram is also done 100% with this Muji fountain pen and some black ink. 
so stay tuned for that. So yeah, really short, really quick video, nothing overly fancy, just some quick sketches, just how I like it. Stay tuned for some bigger drawings that are coming up here on this channel, uh, check out some of my other videos. Uh, if you like what you see, give the video the thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Uh, I really appreciate every single new subscriber. Instagram, Redbubble, everything's linked in the description. And yeah, I hope I'll see you next time, okay? Bye.